Hello, my name is Mithla Shronavali and I'm Chief Medical Officer and Biostatistician at Data Clinic. At Data Clinic, we specialize in biostatistics, CEMR, which is Centralized Electronic Medical Records, and the analysis of health data. Today, I would like to discuss a technique known as Generalized Linear Modeling, or GLMs. So GLMs fall under the um, regressional umbrella and include linear regression, logistic regression, Poisson regression, and other forms of exponential regression. So GLMs all share an independent outcome. That means there's no resampling or correlation between the outcome values, and the outcome is exponentially distributed. Furthermore, there is a linear combination of the predictors under a monotonic function. For example, linear regression uses a normal distribution, which is, the, which is an exponential distribution, and it combines the predictors as is, using the identity function. So GLMs can tailor a better model to predict your outcome and help you understand your data better. So what happens when your data doesn't fit a typical linear regression model in that the outcome is not normally distributed, or a logistic regression model in that the outcome is not just a yes or no answer? Then you should come to Data Clinic, because at Data Clinic we have a variety of generalized linear models to fit your data. So firstly, we have linear regression, which is when the outcome is normally distributed, such as height or weight. Then there is logistic regression, where the outcome is either yes or no, or dead or alive, like that. Or there is conditional logistic regression, when the outcome is a series of two questions, both yes or no. Or there's Poisson regression, where we look at the number of events over a fixed period of time, such as the incident rate or binomial regression, where there is the number of positive outcomes over the number of total outcomes, or nominal regression, where there are many categories, or ordinal regression, where there are categories are ordered from highest to lowest, or log-linear regression, which compares a multi-category outcome to a multi-category predictor. So generalized linear models have a variety of techniques that you can use to model your data. And this shows our commitment at data clinics towards advanced biostatistical techniques. In conclusion, generalized linear modeling is a robust and flexible way to model your data. We suggest that you come to data clinic at the study conception itself so we can build a study design based on your hypothesis that correctly and efficiently utilizes GLNs.